Hello and welcome back. In this video, I will show you how to use the Do Once node. Let's get started. So this node has three inputs and one output pin. The first two input pins are execution pins, and the last one is a boolean. Now on the other side you have one completed execution pin. Now this node is a macro, that means you can access this node in any blueprint. So here is a little example. When I press the letter A on my keyboard, it will run the do once node. And if start closed is false, then it will run completed and it will print a string to my screen. But how the do once node works is that once it's run once, it cannot be run a second time. So that's where the letter D comes in. When I press D, it will reset the do once node. And once it's reset, then it can be run again. So here I'm going to show you how it looks like. So when I press play, I minimize this window. Now when I press A, for the first time, it will print hello. When I press the second time, the do once node is locked. It cannot be run again. Until I press the letter D, which resets the do once node. And once it's reset and I press A again, then you can run the print string. So that's how it works. If I keep pressing A, it will not do anything until I press reset. Now as for the start closed, if I enable that, and I play again, you're going to see that in the beginning, if I press A, it will be closed. So it's not going to run the print string. So I first need to reset the do once node, and then I can print the string. So that's how the do once node works. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. If you have any questions, please feel free to comment down below. And if you have any suggestions on other tutorials I should make, please comment as well. Don't forget to like, share, and most of all, please subscribe. And I'll see you in the next video. See you soon!